Welcome back to the channel everybody. I want to thank you for hitting that play button. Is this your very first time stopping by? My name is Chuck and on this channel we pretty much deal with almost everything Corvettes. But today I'm actually out here at something that's called Cars and Gasoline uh, here in the Tulsa area. Now we're very blessed in that we have several different car shows that happen throughout the each and every month during uh, during the summertime. Today we're out here we've got uh, all kinds of uh, we got a Dodge Viper of course we got exotics we've got Porsches we've got Corvettes we've got BMWs um, there's just a lot of really cool cars out here uh, but let's go ahead and let's walk around and let's check out some of these things. If I wasn't a Corvette guy, this right here would be my car. <laughs> the GT3 RS, I think, is yeah, outside of the ZR1 for me anyway, is just an absolute amazing car. I mean, the spacing of these tires. Look at that. Holy cow. Look at that. That is just, I just, I, out of all the Porsches, the GT3 RS is definitely definitely the car I would get I would get this and it would be in white with all black accents uh, but that's uh, you're looking at you know to spec them out right especially if he's got the yeah the black lights inside and this is a $220,000 car probably somewhere in there absolutely gorgeous let me know what you think you guys like uh, like the Porsches here I think the value that you get with a ZL1 is just I mean just stock I mean these cars are you're talking in the upper 60s uh, actually mid 60s and you're getting basically the same engine as the Z06 you're getting you know a car that is just totally ready to go for the for the track the wheels on this this is kind of that kind of space gray type product there but then, you know, if you want to take this car to the next level, you can do so by doing the 1LE if you really are going to be tracking. But you can see just... I've heard a lot of good things about this car.
I am really, I really am kind of sad to see that Dodge has discontinued the Viper. You know, yes, it's, you know, probably not one of the most comfortable cars to drive. Um, someone, uh, this gentleman actually told me it's pretty close to like driving uh, a ZL1 1LE. Um, just the suspension, everything on them is just so tight. Like seeing cars like this being produced, you know, I don't care the manufacturer. Um, just anytime you're making any type of high-end sports car, I think that's uh, definitely something that, that you want to continue. Maybe, hey, who knows, maybe Dodge will bring it back. I'm sure they will at some point. Um, tell the boys over at Fiat they need to, <laughs> they need to bring it back. we got the GT500. Of course, uh, Ford's about to release their newest version of this, and they're saying it's going to be, quote-unquote, a demon killer. <laughs> so we'll see what... Uh, what happens with the uh, 500? I'm a fan of the of the Ford products. You know the Shelby products, the GT350, GT500, and we yeah, we've got the uh, you know anytime the exotics start taking around and winding. Their the guy one time he said, "Hey Chuck, you know every time I hear that, it sounds like a bunch of weed eaters." <laughs> so, uh, some of the exhausts are really cool. Some of them just kind of sound like somebody started a weed eater. The temperature. I know where you are has got to be. I think it's today it's supposed to be 105. I know some of you guys have been telling me it's going to be like 110 where some of you are. Uh, but again, I wanted to bring you out to this show real quick video. Just check out some cool cars. I do want you to make sure you remember this next Saturday, July 29th or July 28th, I believe it is actually. Uh, I'm going to be up in the Kansas City area doing a meetup with you guys. Um, all of the information is linked in the description below. Love to be able to have you come out, see your car, get some footage of your car for a future vlog, and then also just meet you. Uh, that's what this is about, is just us guys getting out, enjoying, or ladies, uh, getting out enjoying these amazing cars. And you don't have to have a Corvette to show up. If you've got a, uh, you know, it doesn't matter if you have a Honda or you got a Volkswagen or anything like that, feel free to uh, come out to the event. We'd definitely love to have you. Uh, if you watch the channel, that's what it's all about, is me meeting the people who watch these videos. But guys, until I see you at the next video, I hope each and every one of you have a blessed rest of your week. Now let's check out some of your beautiful rides. Yeah.